I'm just doing a quick tutorial to show people the M2P object snap and also how to set up a shortcut with this object snap using the CUI, the customizable user interface. M2P stands for middle between two points. And I'll just do it once again to show you. So for me, I don't like using the right quick click menu and I don't like typing M2P on the keyboard. I find it slows me down a little bit. Okay, so I think you have the idea of what that object snap does. It's very useful in a lot of cases. So I'm gonna type CY to get into the customizable user interface. Now to create a new command, I can click this button here, but now I gotta find the command I just created. It's going to be this command one right here. So I have a command placeholder. This will save you some time because you can just right click and duplicate it. So I recommend having something like similar to what I have. So I'm going to go, go into the macro. This would just cancel any active command. We don't actually want that to happen. So I'm going to type M2P and semicolon. Ma in macros, the semicolon is same as hitting enter, more or less. I'm going to, I'm going to hit a, apply. I'm going to go up to here. I'm going to find keyboard shortcuts right there. I copied it, I'm going to paste it into here. You can do that, you just click on the command, right click, copy, right click, paste. It'll appear in here. Okay, so I'm going to set up the actual shortcut. Now one thing, you'll, you'll probably have to turn your caps lock off when you do this, or it, um, it assumes you want to hit the the shift key at the same time when you're setting up these shortcuts. So I'm actually going to set my M2P to control M. Now we're not done quite yet. We got to make sure nothing else is control M. I don't think there is. It usually gives you a warning if I remember correctly. So we're going to close this and see if this works. I'm going to go into my line command. I'm going to hit control M. This is especially useful if you have to do this quite often. It's much quicker than typing M2P as I just did. And obviously your shortcut can be anything you want it to be. So in the future, hopefully I'll, I'll be able to show you even more useful CUI shortcuts. Thanks for watching.